Hi, this is Jeremy. Uh, welcome back to the channel. We are going to show off my 2020 ball python investment snakes that we picked up this year and I'm in a contest. Alright, so we're going to start off first with this girl right here. Now I know I said my pickups from 2020, but she was actually December 2019. She is a Bongo Ultra Male female. She's got a little bit of size to her, but man, look how look how gorgeous she looks. I don't know if it's the Bongo that lightens up the sides here a little bit. If I can get her head to move around. But yeah, very awesome looking. All right. Now it's that girl right there. And like I mentioned earlier, I am in a contest. Okay, so I was on a podcast. I was asked to be on what they call 15 Minutes of Lame. Snakes and the Fat Man um, is running this contest right now. And there's nine of us total. And the last time they told me, or last time I checked, I think I was like in second place. And then a few days before that, I was in fourth place. We're all kind of doing circles. Shane with Small Town Exotics, he's been knocking it out of the park. <laughs> but anyways, I can use your vote. Let's shake Shane up a little bit, you know. Um, maybe win this thing, and I can do it with your help. If you've already voted, perfect. Especially if you voted for me. Um, if you have any relatives, you know, husband, wife, sons, daughters, mothers, whatever, any relatives, friends, or whatever, Get them to vote for me too. I would really appreciate that. That's if you go to snakes and the fat man PC.com or actually it's S A T F M P C.com and I will write that down here so you'll see that. Um, also check out his, uh, his, he's got a YouTube channel and I'm kind of jealous because his editing skills are mine kind of suck, I think, but. His look really good and comparable to Shane and all the other big dogs out there. And he also is on Instagram, so check out Instagram. His name is Chris Eaton, but uh, you could probably just put in Snakes and the Fat Man and that'll take you to all those um, inlets that he has for social media. So, um, and also, I'm going to have in here all the other contestants as well. Check out all their social media. Some of them have YouTube, some of them have... I think all of them probably have Instagram and Facebook and all that stuff. Um, but check all them out too as well. Give them some love, but only vote for me. And we'll go ahead and get back to my investment ball pythons. All right. So now we're going to go with back to the 2020 pickups. Which we're going to start off with this guy right here. Now this is a uh, pastel blackhead. And I just think he looks really good. It looks like somebody took a highlighter or something around the alien's heads. And, well, you can just see for yourself how cool he looks. Now, it's not het for anything. And um, I'm good with that because what I'm going to put him with, there's there's nothing on the market to even to, to purchase right now. So I have to make my own. But this is a good starting point for me. Um, but, yeah, that, so this is... This is him right here. He's a pastel blackhead. Really cool looking animal. Okay, then we're going to go ahead and move to another male that I picked up. And this guy, which just happens to be in a little bit of shed right now, or getting ready to start shedding. It looks a little dull. But he is a yellow belly confusion, 66% het lavender albino. You can see the pink belly, but man, look at the crazy busyness. If I can get him to stop spinning around. But look at that, look at that belly pattern. That's the confusion doing that. So yeah, I got some big plans for this guy here in the future. And then let's move on to... This guy right here. I should have a little bit of rep the chip on him. 
But um, this is a, another male, and he is a mahogany 100% heck clown. It's a very cool looking. I got a couple plans for this guy. I actually won him in one of those UR, US ARC auctions over in Tampa, Florida. Or no. No, this was Daytona. Yeah, I won him in a Daytona um, auction. But yeah, it was for US ARC. Got a little bit of size to him. Very cool looking animal. All right, so that moves us on to now. Now this is a, a real powerhouse and this guy has a lot of girls. He's got, I think, six females. Or I'll probably just put him with three and I'll probably get another male down the road for the other three. But he is a Cypress Honey Orange Dream Double Het Desert Ghost Krypton. So when I say double het desert ghost krypton, he's 100% het desert ghost, and he's either going to be 100% het clown or 100% het cryptic. It's going to be one of those two. And if you watched the last video I posted of my holdbacks, you can it's pretty obvious what girls that I'm putting this guy with. So he's going to make some really really awesome hatchlings here in the next few years. So again, Cypress Orange Dream, Honey, Double Het, Hungry, <laughs> or Snippy, but yeah, Double Het, Desert Ghost, Krypton. Very cool looking animal. Okay, now we go to this guy here. You notice most of my, my pickups this were males. I have a ton, a ton of females. I didn't have that many males. Not as many as I should have had. Anyways, yeah, he's a normal, but he's a double het, possible triple het. So he is 100% het lavender albino. He is 100% het and 50% het pied. Another powerhouse male that I uh, plan on doing some big things with in the future. All right, so back to the contest that I'm in. Um, I was very grateful for Chris Eaton. He, I'm a huge fan of his. Um, I listened to his podcast for probably the last three years, you know, when I started into, you know, getting into breeding again and stuff. A um, lot of good, a lot of good um, interviews he has, a lot of high-end breeders and a lot of very, very good information, you know. This guy knows a lot of people. He's interviewed people across the whole world so definitely check out his podcast check out his instagram check out his uh youtube and you know his facebook all that stuff um again like i said earlier too check out all the other contestants too you know they got some really good stuff you know um but i i'm the one that wants to vote don't give them guys the vote give it to me Get your friends, your families, everybody else. Vote for Bod's Exotic Reptiles. Uh, thanks again. You guys have a good one. And stay tuned for the next video in the next week or so.